New at 5 now, one veteran and her family are calling Osceola County home, all thanks to one organization. Yeah, through the Building Homes for Heroes program, the family received a home mortgage-free. New 6's Clay Lepard shows us how that program is getting results. Okay, here she comes, everybody. Quite the welcome home. Welcome home. Yay! For Army veteran Jerry Birchmack and her daughter, Zatroya. This is so amazing. You have no idea. I dreamt about this every night since they called me. The two are moving into this home outside Kissimmee, mortgage-free, thanks to the Building Homes for Heroes program. Jerry is... A very giving person. She would give the shirt off her back and for her to receive this home is like the most amazing feeling. The program helps out veterans who served after 9-11 and are dealing with emotional and physical challenges since they came home. <gasps> oh my yes, gosh, this is I got so cute! Feet. Look at Birchmeck served as an Army specialist in Iraq, and even she admits she shouldn't be here today after she thought she was going to die when an explosion wedged her between her truck and a brick wall. My sacrifice and hard work paid off, even though in the beginning I was thinking that it didn't. And it just, it means, it just means, it's so much to me and my daughter. You have no idea. And look, you have a second family room. Birchmack still deals with seizures and nightmares from her time serving. I love this. This is beautiful. But with this home, along with the newly acquired master's degree, this Army veteran is looking forward to what's next, whatever that may be. This home is going to mean uh, a new beginning, uh, bigger and better things, a happier, secure life for my daughter and I. The Homes for Heroes program plans on giving out another home in the Kissimmee area next week and a handful more throughout Central Florida throughout the rest of the year. In Osceola County, Clay Lepard, News 6.